one of my messages, one of the Committee of the Regions messages is that we need pioneering regions. But we continue that every region can be a pioneer. So because some are focusing on this, some on that, some on that, and in, at different levels. But when, when uh, pioneers are normally more, they are not planning and planning and planning. They are uh, experimenting, they are eager to get something new out of their experience. And that helps, and that uh, helps on, on not only that region or that person who is doing that, but helps uh, the other and, and others, and that's where we need to use more of this digitalization opportunity. So having kind of a building our, what we could call the digitalized innovation platforms. Not just, uh, let's say, web pages, not just material, but creating the joint collaborative, co-creative culture. And there, this advantage of having people with the different backgrounds, not only different geographical backgrounds, but different ages, different disciplines, different tasks, whatever their own work experience or study experiences are. That's, that's I think, that is the advantage of Europe and that's where we uh, should take the full uh, advantage out of. Top down or bottom up. Today, definitely for the next year, so I'm very convinced that the European policy will be very strongly bottom-up. And not just uh, on a kind of random basis, but like a bottom-up movement. And we need, as policymakers at the European level, we need to encourage this. Because then we get the, the kind of new developments moving on. We, we get more instead of planning and planning or talking and talking. We got concrete uh, experimentation, so concrete demonstrations, learn from those, organize pilot activities, again in collaboration between different cities, uh, regions, universities in different parts of Europe. And everyone can learn more out of that. So everyone, uh, every uh, region from this perspective should have their, this kind of uh, partnership activities, uh, testing, taking risk as well. But if one is doing that exactly focused on this, the other one a bit differently, third a bit, a bit more again differently and so on. So you can try. Uh, trial and error is, is a good part of, of speeding up in, in the future inventions. Definitely there are big cultural differences, but it's not not that much only, let's say, north and south uh, or whatever. It can be you, your next door neighbor is not always at all at the same level of your, let's say, innovative thinking or how to implement this. It can be that your best collaborators are far, thousands of kilometers far away and, and you are still, through the digitalization, you are feeling that you are really working along with them all the time. So the cultural differences, definitely, they are important and to keep in mind and take into account on this. But uh, that's the strength of Europe, so that we have these diversities, so that we really can take the full advantage of this kind of uh, development.